hey beautiful people in this video i'm gonna share a list of universities waving gie for spring 2023 and fall 2023 but before we begin i will discuss what are the pros and cons of not taking gie and also let you know why universities offer gie waiver and about the situations you will face if you don't take the gie usually two types of universities offer gie waiver the universities with high ranking or the universities with very low ranking. Low ranking universities offer GIE waiver to attract applicants. So, therefore, they only see at your undergraduation CGPA to make a decision. Just like you, many students are now looking at the GIE waived off universities. So, the competition for the GIE waived off universities increasing when compared to universities with GIE requirement. So, your application face more competition. Uh, let's say you got the admit and you decided to go to that university. You will go to visa interview and here you may face the real problem. Visa interview officer may ask you whether you take GRE or not. You will say no, I don't take GRE. Then visa officer may think you apply to GRE waived off universities because you are not talented enough to write GRE or he may think you are not the strong candidate for MS program and may reject your visa. Recently, my senior visa got rejected because she didn't take GRE. The visa officer asked, did you take the GRE? She said no and she said she got admit with Duolingo exam itself. Then immediately, visa officer returned the passport. I am not saying everyone get rejected but it completely based on our luck and visa interview officer. Maybe every visa interview officer won't ask about GRE but sometimes rejections happen because of GRE. Many people got visas without taking GRE also. So think wisely and take decision on taking GRE. If you think you can manage visa interview officer with your CGPA or with the reasons for not taking GRE, it's up to you. But remember, rejections happen sometimes, only sometimes because of not taking GRE. And I'm gonna give you the list, but remember, universities provide GRE waivers for particular programs in their university only. So, you need to cross-check whether the university provided waiver for your program or not. You need to cross-check again whether the university is providing waiver for the program that you are interested to apply. Sometimes universities change their policies in terms of GRE, IELTS or TOEFL requirements. So it's good idea to mail the university about the GRE requirement for the particular program you are interested to apply. So uh, GRE waivers are three types. GRE is optional but advised. Universities provide GRE waiver but mentions GRE as optional. So here you need to understand that there are good chances if you submit your GRE score. So although GRE is optional, it plays vital role. For those universities, there are high chances of admission if you submit GRE scores because many people apply without GRE. Universities not even ask for GRE scorecard. There is not even option to submit your GRE scores then it's completely okay because no one submits their GRE score so every application is evaluated based on CGPA and SOPs and LORs so everyone has equal chances. In the third case there is option to submit your GRE scores but they won't pay attention to your scores but there is still option to submit your GRE scores. You can jump to the next page without submitting scorecard because it even won't display any error asking you to submit your GRE scores. So there is option but they won't pay attention to your scores. Hope you understand these three types of GRE waivers. So here is the list of universities offering GRE waiver. First one is Northeastern University waived the GRE requirement for the spring 2023. Syracuse University, GRE score optional but advised. Third one is the University of Texas at Austin, GRE score is optional but advised. Fourth one is University of Wisconsin located in Stout, GRE and GMAT is waived. 
फिफ्थ वन इज यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ कैलिफोर्निया लॉस एंजल्स जी आर ई जी मैट वेवर डिपेंड्स ऑन द सेलेक्टेड कोर्स ओनली यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ विस्कॉन्सिन लोकेटेड इन मिलवाकी जी आर ई जी मैट वेवर डिपेंड्स ऑन द सेलेक्टेड कोर्स ओनली सेवेंथ वन इज यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ कैलिफोर्निया बर्कली जी आर ई एंड जी मैट वेवर डिपेंड्स ऑन द सेलेक्टेड कोर्स ओनली एथ वन इन द लिस्ट इज न्यूयॉर्क यूनिवर्सिटी जी आर ई इज ऑप्शनल नाइन्थ वन इज पोर्टलैंड स्टेट यूनिवर्सिटी जी मैट वेवर डिपेंड्स ऑन द सेलेक्टेड कोर्स जी आर ई वेवड यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ विस्कॉन्सिन मैडिसन ग्रैजुएट स्कूल डजेंट रिक्वायर द जी आर ई लेवेंथ वन इज यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ एरिजोना ट्वेल्थ वन इन द लिस्ट इज रईस यूनिवर्सिटी थर्टींथ वन इन द लिस्ट इज फ्लोरिडा स्टेट यूनिवर्सिटी फोर्टींथ वन इज न्यूयॉर्क इंस्टिट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी फिफ्टींथ वन इज कैलिफोर्निया स्टेट यूनिवर्सिटी लॉन्ग बीच सो दीज आर फिफ्टीन यूनिवर्सिटीज दट वेविंग ऑफ जी आर ई देर आर अदर यूनिवर्सिटीज दट आर वेविंग ऑफ द जी आर ई फॉर स्प्रिंग ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री एंड फॉल ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री आई विल डिस्प्ले द रिमाइनिंग यूनिवर्सिटीज लिस्ट हियर डू रिसर्च फ्रॉम यूअर साइड ऑल्सो बिकॉज जी आर ई वेवर्स और प्रोग्राम स्पेसिफिक If you have any doubt please mail the university to know more clearly do research from your side because GRE waivers or program specific I hope this list will help you to apply GRE waiver of universities and all the very best for your MS journey